On to the D2 prelims now. We'll start with the girls 100, the first heat, and Ottawa Glandorf's Madison Steckschulte. Steckschulte, fifth in her heat at 12.29, but she does make the finals. In the second heat, Liberty Benton and Michaela Butler, the top time all day, 12.01 seconds. So Butler moving on to the finals. Girls, four by two relay. Versailles, Haley Winner. The anchor, second in the heat, 143.51. OG finishes third, so they will both race tomorrow. Boys turn at the 4x200 relay. And St. Mary's, time of 132.02 to finish up a great season for the Rough Riders relay team. Girls 4x1 relay. And Liberty Benton anchored by Michaela Butler. They would take third place. Winner and the Versailles Tigers also move on to the finals as well. Same discipline, but now the guys running. Elida Bulldogs in the 4x1 relay. Avery Sumter gets the dogs a mark of 43.97, but they just missed the finals by one spot. Girls 300 hurdles now. And Van Wert's Whitney Myers finishes at a time of 48.47 seconds to wrap up her junior season. Girls 200, start with Heat 1. And once again, Maddie Steckschulte doing it again. A third final, she takes third in the Heat, 25.25. Bath of Jocelyn Ayers takes the final qualifying spot, so she'll wrap up her senior season tomorrow as well. Heat 2, the defending champion, Michaela Butler. Yeah, she's really fast. 25.05 in this race. She'll be back on Saturday in this event as well. Boys 200, and Van Wert Cougar Nicholas Krug finishing in 22.18 seconds. That is the eighth spot, so he will be in the finals tomorrow. Finally, girls, four by four, first heat. And Ottawa Glandorf and Alyssa Ellerbrock take second. They are moving on, and they will be joined by the Versailles Tigers as Amanda Winner anchoring the leg for Versailles as they take the second heat in three minutes and five, eight seconds.